I'll try. I don't think I, don't, I want to try. I don't anything. think it exists anymore. But when I was a young woman. Oh my God! No. Oh. Boom, Chesh Luja. What's up, people? Hola, Vigos, Mom and Vigos, Dad here. Welcome to another episode. Guys, welcome to the second part of Getting Drunk the Polish Way, Yay. the beer edition, Pivna Edizia. And I went to the local Polish shop here in London, around my place, and got some amazing beers. Uh, some of them amazing. I know. <laughs> You're very excited. You haven't drunk uh, alcohol in like two months. So He's gonna be on the floor. We're not drinking alcohol since you know late December. Yeah. Trying to you know clean our systems and let's face it, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be 40. I, I need to. I, I cannot deal with this shit anymore. <laughs> so we decided to you know just lay off the booze for a while. You know we did the the, the pandemic dance. You know we, we are not convincing with all the beers here on the table. I'm only gonna do this damage to myself. <laughs> so I got Carolina some some non-alcoholic beers right yep. here. Okay, what do we have here? I'm gonna start from the left. All the way to the non, you know, non-alcoholic that no one cares about. <laughs> Some of them are actually really, really good. For example, the first one is called Polski well, Chmiel. You know they're good, but they, they, they seem good, right? They seem really good. Yeah. I mean, come on, look at this bottle. Artisanal and all this fancy stuff. Yeah, this looks like it's styled uh, like the beer from, you know, the socialist or communist era in Poland. So yeah. I think it's gonna be good. It looks like a, it, this has my high hopes. You know some of them, right? And obviously, Żywiec, this is very known. Of course, Pe Perua. Also, Castellan yeah. was actually my very favorite for for quite a while. What do we know about beers in general? Because when people are tasting, wine tasting or beer tasting, yeah. they go by like types and stuff, like lager or IPA, I, and I don't know anything I about that. I think that most of these are lagers, I think. You guys know a lot about your yeah. alcohols, you my Polish peeps. So let me know if you say, dude, that is not a lager, that is an IPA. I am gonna guess that most of the Polish beer, beers are lagers. Here where we live down in the UK, they have like gazillion types of, of, of beers. And another one is uh, Staropolski. Historical recipe or something like that. I wonder if it tastes like a, like a pierogi. <laughs> <laughs> my association was actually a lot worse. I was thinking, does it have, you know, like rats in it or something? Oh my God, rats? Yeah, because Middle Ages. <laughs> Shit got very dark very fast. <laughs> Let's move on from the rat topic. <laughs> Those in the bottles, they look like um, like vintage. This one looks like from the Mad Men. I, I don't know if you guys seen the show. Okay, so this is the fancy schmancy thing. Now we go to the, you know, good old, I just want to buy a one pound can of beer. Yeah, and, and throw it in the park. It. Yeah, exactly. This is the Perua Miodova. For the guy you have the, you know. <laughs> No, the guy will, be, will have like Dembova or Joubre or something that is like bitter and strong. Mm. I really like Jivietz. Uh, I actually have not found here in the UK Jivietz uh, Biawa or Biawe or something. But I, I tried it in Poland several times and I, I really remember, liked it. Yeah. Kastelan is amazing. This one is Niepas de Rizovane. It feels a lot better on your stomach. Like it feels like a little lighter. And then of course from the, you know, the, this, this. The little beer. juice. This is 2%. This might get me drunk. drunk. At this point, <laughs> At this because point, I'm not used to it anymore. Uh -huh. This is 59 pence. No one wants to buy this. <laughs> yes. There you go. That's the that's the dance of the juice. This sounds like we finished the video. We have to drink it now. Sorry. Okay. First one we're gonna try. Lager is my favorite type. And you always want the beer very, very cold because that's how you drink it in the Dominican Republic. Yes. Your beers are like ice cold. Yeah. But different types of beers yeah. are supposed to be served at different temperatures. And yeah. a lot of them are not supposed to be drink, yeah. drunk, really, really cold. And these ones are actually yeah. normal. Like they were in the fridge, they were not in the freezer. So I'm possibly I'll, I'm not gonna enjoy them as much, but they are gonna taste as they were intended, I okay. guess, right? Here it goes. Okay. Our first one. Is this one? But maybe I should also join you and try something. Yeah, 59p elixir. It's left, left free with some fruit in it. Nazdrovie. Nazdrovie. Salud. That smells like a syrup. You didn't even smell it. You have to do like they do, like they just roll it around and sniff it a little. I just wanted to get to the beer. It's really good. <laughs> Once again, if it was really, really That's cold, so horrible. it would be the best. <laughs> Mine was good, very good. I'm gonna give it a. 
solid 8 out of 10. Is it bitter or is it sour or is it sweet? Do you want to have like a one little sip? You can give me just a Like a sip? Time. Yeah, she's gonna have that. Yeah, it's bitter. Ooh. Like a little bitter on the you tongue. You wanna try yeah. this? Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> I remember when we started. That's not bad. Facebook dating. This tastes like one of those, you know, um, energy drinks that oh my life. god yes i can see this is not gonna end up well for me <laughs> this was one of my favorite beers i have a very beautiful memory be yeah of course because this is the beer that the would um get some of this for for us when we yeah. came back home mama ella would put him in the freezer for me she's having this one. Oh, i'm sorry Gibi yeah, Gibi Gibi zero Cling. good old Jiver. It's great. This beer is actually a heavy beer. You're not gonna believe it. In my mind, it's like a, it's like a winter beer, if I, if I can say that. You know, it's like a, it's cold outside and it's like a, it's rich. It's like, it's like a soup. It feels like it's made of oatmeal. You know? <laughs> <laughs> One of those is gonna make you feel like you just had dinner. Do you want, do you want this? Let me try them. This one, when juice. you first taste it, is sweet and then has bitter aftertone. Oh my god, it tastes, it, it tastes sweet, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna give Jive, come on, 9.5, 9.8. I love this beer. Do you feel drunk already? Come on, no. In Dominican Republic, people are not really uh, big drinkers, per se. What's your most famous beer? Uh, it's called Presidente. It's, uh, it's a very light lager, designed to be drank very, very cold. And how, did, say how it's cold, when it's very, very yeah. cold. It's, when it gets very cold, it gets like almost frosty, and they call it Vestida de Novia, which means uh, dressed as a bride, because your brides are white. Yeah. Start a polskie. As you consume alcohol. Try first for me. Mmm. Smooth. It, how does it taste? Still a little bit bitter. Yeah, but I, I probably would not taste as bitter if it was colder. I exactly. got used to drinking very cold beers, like, with you. Oh yeah, she became Dominican in that sense. She's like, put yeah. those beers in the freezer for us. <laughs> very good. But it's good. 8.5. said, I was not, I've never been a big drinker, and actually, I used to hate beer for the longest time. It was, it, I tasted bad, yeah, I tasted bitter. It starts like that with everyone. I used to go out with my friends, uh, and I used to get some, you know, Smirnoff, Smirnoff ice, you remember these drinks? But it used to get very expensive because, first of all, they don't really do nothing to you. You drink it very fast, like, like uh, sodas or something. I told my friend, you know what? I'm, I'm just gonna get a beer because I hate it so much that it's gonna last the whole night. <laughs> that's, that's the student thinking. For but did hours. you see this culture that you believe it's so hard to relax without alcohol and to like chill or party? Yeah. Even when you don't like it, you still buy it because you feel you need it. As a matter of fact, it's a, it's one of the reasons why we are not drinking alcohol. Sometimes things get a little bit out of hand. I mean, I'm not saying we got out of hand. We were not here getting drunk or nothing. We still we were still on duty every night. Yeah. But you know, we would have a beer every other night or or sometimes for a week or two it was every night a little yeah, beer or a little wine. bit of wine. You know, we decided, listen, maybe maybe we should just lay off the sauce for a while yeah, because well, yeah. Okay, so let me serve this. Kultove, jasne lager. Try A little bit, maybe. How is it? Mm -hmm. Too bitter. Bitter? Very bitter. I, I think if it was really, really cold, it would be very enjoyable. Kultove. Kultove. You know what I'm thinking? Kulturove every time I see it. <laughs> want, to, want to go for another one of the zero alcohol? You want okay, to go for let the me try the left? cranberry one. I like, I like the color. It has no gas and it's not cold enough. Maybe this is like piccolo. I'll, tr I'll try it. I don't think I, don't, I want to try it. I don't it think there. it exists anymore, but when I was a young woman... Oh my god, no! Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <Ooh. laughs> and when we started going out, whenever you go to a, a bar or a pub, you get a beer from the keg, right? Yeah. Uh, girls would get a beer with a little bit of raspberry syrup on the bottom. Okay. It was before all the flavored beers, Okay. I think. I, appear on the market yeah and that's what it reminds me of all the syrup that is left on the bottom but it's not, it doesn't taste bad okay so i'm gonna go with did i try it's closed so i don't think you did try it <laughs> i'm gonna say myself guys i think i am getting a little tipsy mm. i don't feel like it but there's there's no other way <laughs> for me to explain <laughs> i thought i drank this beer and it's closed okay here it goes just put a little go ahead try it this, this smells like some fruit to me. No, but like banana. A banana? Mm -hmm. I like to Apples and banana. <laughs> I like to eat. The Vingo's favorite song. 
It's not bad. It has like a coffee undertone. <laughs> You're tipsy. That's why you like it. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like coffee so though. It does, yeah. It's very good. I'm gonna recommend this to Mama and Tata. Mamo, Tato, this beer, yeah, Guinness, Mama and Tato. Okay, so now we're oh, gonna well. go for the three, you know, working class beers. Uh, you know, the, <laughs> the, the backbone of, of Polish culture and Perua, Miodova. I am not a big fan of, of honey. I don't think it's it. gonna taste like honey. And I don't even know it has honey. I think it just has sugar and they call it honey. It tastes very sweet. Uh, does it taste, it's too sweet. Does it, it taste like, 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 honey. like honey? We don't really eat honey, so... Wow. Yeah, it tastes, it tastes a lot like honey. I, I would have a hard time finishing that. I, and I like sweet things, but uh, hand me this le leg so that I can give you to try. This is leg, right? It's called shandy. Stuff. I remember that when I, w when I went to see, when I went to Warsaw for the first time, yeah. you were buying a, yeah. a beer that had a lemon flavor. There were two that I was buying in those times. It yeah. was red, which is either raspberry or apple. Uh -huh. And the other one was ginger, which was which was ginger flavor beer. And oh, I a still ginger. remember it was so good. So good old uh, Givietz. But this one has like 2% alcohol. So She's already gone. I'm gonna be dancing on tables. You wanna try this one? Try that one first. But like, sweet and sour. Oh wow, it's very lemony. Mm. Very lemony. No. <laughs> Look at her face. Givietz. <laughs> You buy it just to get drunk and forget about your life. Uh, the body and the flavor of it, it of course, has nothing to do with having my vocabulary. You it's know, just nasty, that's all. It, it's not nasty. It's going to be good, I think. Yeah, I, yeah, I love it. I used to love it all the time. I don't know which one was the best. Oh, come on, this is a great beer. Mm. So far, uh, I forgot to rate, start, keep rating them. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to go again. I wanted to remember it. Castellan. Top three. I don't know anymore. Culture over here. Let's go. Mm. Yeah, and it's and it actually feels richer in Did taste. Did you just take a whole gulp? Yeah, it's it's really good. I would say that those ones are really good, very yeah. similar. This one is a, a little richer in in taste. Like you can see that the body is fuller, right? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I need to go back to all of them. <laughs> <laughs> yes, let's do it. Yeah. But I think we should stop after this. One. Okay, so Jive. So for sure, Jive goes here in the top three. Um, so I think that's how it goes, guys. It's a toss between uh, Jive and Castellan, if it was really, really cold. Then very close second, it would be this one. And then it would be this one the third, the fourth. Okay. Should we wrap this up? <laughs> yeah, I don't know anything else to say. Any last <laughs> words, any comments? <laughs> Let's go to the outro. Boom. Boom! That's all, guys. That's the end of the episode. I hope you liked it. He because liked it. I really enjoyed it. Am I <laughs> and rate them worse? if you know them. Oh, please, yeah. Yeah. Let us know. There are many people that don't know those beers, so rate them how much you like them. Suggest yeah. for other, maybe part three of what the Getting else Drunk. What should he try? And oh, oh, and what do you like? Wine, beer, or vodka? Yeah, what do you like? Wine, beer, vodka, and what beers we should try next for the part three of Getting Drunk the Polish way. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. By the way, I checked on my statistics and I think like more than 80% of you guys are not subscribed to my channel. People that watch our videos, mm. you should. Mm. Our battery died, but remember, thumbs up. If you like this, subscribe, bell notification, and see you next week. And don't drink too much. Bye-bye.